About 80 students divided into groups of seven sat on two meter squares of brown paper, the space of an actual house in the developing world, where they worked feverishly to make shopping bags out of old newspaper as people dressed like shop owners yelled commands to make them work faster. The AgriLife Center at Texas A&M University for two hours in September 2015 was arranged like a slum where the students converged for a simulation of life in the developing world. Our goal here is not to replicate the visual nature of it, but rather symbolically for a moment to help people understand a tiny bit of the pressure of what it's like to be desperate. And in that desperation, then what do you do? The event was held by the Hong Kong-based Crossroads Foundation and sponsored by Farmers Fight Advocacy Group, the Office of the Provost, the Norman Borlaug Institute for International Agriculture, and the Bush School of Government and Public Service. This is a simulation designed to help students understand uh, the various issues associated with global poverty. What we will do in this context is we'll divide people into families, and it's, um, for each of these families, their survival will come through their hands, making and selling paper bags. But the shopkeepers are abusive. There's a loan shark who will uh, further oppress them if they are not able to make ends meet and the goal is just in this 30 minute window to help them understand a fraction of what life is like for those who are living in the reality of, of need. It does put you in a situation where you can begin to understand these people and begin to realize that we live incredibly privileged lives and and we all have the social responsibility to do something or help those who, who can't live the way that we do. 2015 marks Crossroads Foundation's second visit to College Station. So last year we invited them to come to Texas A&M and we saw just how uh, big a difference it can make in the students thinking about these issues. It really puts things into perspective. More people, as, much, as many people as, as possible should experience this.